Azul, Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to Agadir, respectively Anza, which is the area here. So it's a little bit outside of uh, the main Agadir, you know. We, we, we live right here, very close, actually, in the area that's called Hanzania. So, but Anza is right next to it, so, you know, kind of like it's almost where we live here. You know, I'm not like it here because it's it's quiet, it's, it's sleepy, it has this village feeling, you know. So, yeah, let me show you that there. Maybe, actually, today is a quiet day. We might actually go and eat some, some food, maybe a, maybe a pizza or something, you know, because we have this crunch. Just, just passing the police station. You know, maybe be careful with the filming bit. <laughs> no, I keep repeating myself about the filming and, and the police and, you know, it's probably no problem anyway, right? Again, it's like three o'clock in the afternoon. It's always like the time we go out between two and three and four. You know, that's actually the, mo the most quiet time uh, from Mor in Morocco, I would say, because that's like, kind of like the siesta time. All right. It's nice, nice little houses. Have different white, pink, blue coloring. Like this. Actually, I like it. They're probably very basic houses, I would say. All right, let's go. Uh, try, to, try, try one of those restaurants. Maybe we'll try a pizza today because I've been wanting to try the pizza Morocco, which is a quite popular thing, actually. Check out these houses. I like this. I like it a lot. Huh? I mean, they're very small, you don't get me wrong, I know there's not rich people living here. But, you know, rich at heart, you know. Sometimes poor people are happier than the rich ones, that's actually true. Ah, oh, nice little streets here. These houses. Mr. Cat, how are you? Yay. So where to go? Yeah, we just got here a few days ago. We're still not sure where what is. It is not much happening in this area here, in this yeah place called Anza, which is which has a beach, which is a quite cool beach. I want to show you actually. But yeah, lots of things are closed now. We eat at odd hours sometimes, you know, like at three o'clock in the afternoon. Come on, guys, why? Yeah, I can tell you why. It's because, you know, we have late breakfast and then, you know, until the kids eat, it'll take so long. Uh, you know, sometimes they eat breakfast at 11 or 12, so that's why we're not hungry at 12 or 1, you know. So 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock, it's like uh, the thing. Let me show you the beach, which is right there, you know. Then we'll go and have, grab a bite a little bit after. I see, it's right here. There's some restaurants, some, I don't know, cafe, is that cafe or is that beach? Not even sure. Looks like, I mean, is that cafe or is it a restaurant? I'm not sure if they actually serve food here. But probably, nobody's eating. But nobody's eating at this time. Anyway, check out the Lianza Beach. Wow, huh? That's a that's some power there. Pretty cool. Hey. Oh yeah, there's some cafe and there they definitely do serve fish and seafood. But the kids want a pizza, you know. <laughs> Actually I would like to eat some some sardines again. I got so hooked on sardines since we visited uh, Safi. And of course, sardines are just as fresh here, I would say. But anyway, I wanna see this real quick, which, you know, looks like some Soviet symbol, really. But we're Morocco. Isn't that odd? I don't know. Yeah, it has something, something Soviet about it. You know, with the, with the with the globe and the, I don't know, 
just just uh, caught my eye from afar. Anyway, check out the beach real quick. Oh wow, it's quite wavy today. And actually, see, it was it's very cloud. It was very cloudy earlier, and yeah, like dusty. But, you know, now the sun is coming through. It doesn't actually look as good as it usually does because of uh, the, 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 the clouds or the fog, whatever you want to call that. I don't even know what it is. Quite nice, but I, I'll, I think I'll make another beach video uh, because I, I want to head to the restaurant to get some food because the kids are, you know, hungry. Gotta feed them. I sure as hell will be eating some uh, seafood here, some, you know, whatever, shrimp, sardines, whatever. I mean, I did try some, it's good. It's, it, I mean, this is like the, fr the freshest you can imagine, you know, here along the Moroccan coast, you know. It's just a paradise for seafood lovers, fish lovers. Anyway, yeah, it's a nice beach. I like the Anza Beach. See these houses here? They're also very relaxed, you know, kind of oldish, but they're very cool, I like them. Very typical for the area. But a few of these, you know, snack restaurants where you can get, you know, like the usual fare, the burger, the taco, the pizza, you know, these kind of things, the shawarma. So there's a few of them around here too, so it's not only like these, uh, these seafood restaurants. See, this one is as well one. The snack Yassin. All right. Doesn't serve pizza. Let's try it further over there. At uh, Mr. Mr. Borge. Borge. Let's try it. All right, here they have pizza. Let's try the famous Moroccan pizza. Right, we order some pizza and they're making them fresh, which is you know, not surprising. So let's check it out. I ordered three kinds. I ordered the regular pizza margarita, the vegetarian, and one with tuna. Oh, that's actually quite a nice interior, I would say. I asked them to turn off the music, you know, because YouTube. Yeah, I like it. It looks like it's a chain, but uh, that guy he speaks English, so uh, I could ask him <laughs> if this actually looks like a chain, like a Mr. Mr. Borge. Mr. Borge. By his left, the guy, the guy who runs the show. See here, you can, you can. This is actually quite, quite a known place here. The best pizza in town. Double burger. Ah, wow, yeah. Looks good. I guess I have to try everything here. But today only pizza. <laughs> Alright, looks good. All right. So you have this four years? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. This is Very nice. uh, That's your Instagram? Yeah, Instagram. You can You can follow him on Mr. Borde. In Instagram, yeah, you know, you get connections yeah. and and you know, find a way here. Yeah. Very easy. Okay, see you. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's done. It's done. Yeah. The tuna. I should order all the three only because I thought it were bigger, but it's yeah, still regular size. Ah, that's the vegetarian. All right. Looks good. Nice. Let's, let's try these thingies, these pizzas, which look good. Although they have olives on them, and everybody knows Mr. Moonchen don't like no olives. But that's all right. Actually, it's not so bad now. Anyway, so I'm trying the vegetarian one first, right? Or maybe I should. Yes, I'm trying the vegetarian first. Right, so I'm lucky there's not even an olive in size. It's a nice, nice, nice size, you know, not too thick, not too, not too thin. And it seems to have a, a, 
okay amount of cheese on them. Mm. 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 It's very cheesy, I like it. It's a good, definitely a good pizza. Mm. Good pizza, definitely. Mr. Bordy, yeah, come and check it out. Is it good? <laughs> okay. Like it too? Yes? <laughs> and the vegetarian, um, the, the margarita one. Which is funny, the margarita one in Morocco, I've, I've seen it everywhere. It has always some olives on it and some uh, pepperoni. Uh, pepperoni being uh, like the, the 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 peppers, you know, the green and red peppers. I don't know. You know, because because in, in Italy or in wherever in Europe, uh, margarita is only, only like with cheese and tomato sauce. But anyway, let's try how it is, how it is here. Good, huh? What do you think? Mm -hmm. mm. It's very good. Perfect pizza. I mean, perfect. What's a perfect pizza, right? But it's fair enough. Definitely good. Good pizza. Not, not disappointed. I had one in, in Marrakesh, which was not so great, and had one in Marrakesh that was very good. So, but you know, generally, uh, pizza is very popular in, in Morocco, and they're, you know, they're good. Well done, generally. I'll try the tone, the tuna, the tun. Uh, okay. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if this is fresh tuna or if it comes from a can, but I think usually it comes from a can, right? Not even sure. Let's try it. Also has the the, the pepperoni peppers, the, the red pepper and the green pepper on it, and there's some olives usually, onions, cheese. Makes a good pizza to me. Mmm. Mm. I like this one. Mm, it's a very good one. There's something about Morocco and tuna. I've noticed that. There's not a lot of tuna being eaten. But also in Tunisia I saw this. But of course it's 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 at the at the ocean. I mean Morocco has the Atlantic coast and it's got a Mediterranean and lots of fish around. But tuna is like particularly loved, I think. Mm, I don't like very good. It's like the pizza here. Yeah. Very good. It's very good, eh? Yeah. Exactly. I think I would even say it's the best in Morocco we've had so far. Would you agree? Yeah. In Morocco, it's definitely the best pizza. Yeah. It's a boy. Yeah, then you have to add, it actually, the pizza, it looks also like it does on the picture, you know. <laughs> when they, but sometimes, you know, it's false advertisement, pretty bad. Yeah, that's good. I mean, it looks good and it tastes good. Visit this guy, a good yeah. place, good pizza. And what's your best food? The taco or the pizza Thank or you. the burger? <laughs> Everything. <laughs> okay. Yes, I do. I, I'm not, I've not tried it here, but I will next time. Inshallah. All right. Bye bye. Zama. All right. Let's go. Yalla, yalla. Slama. All right. So, yeah, good pizza. Good place. Nice guys. At Mr. Borje, right here in Anza, right next to the beach, basically. Slama. <laughs> and right next to whatever that is here. Yeah. Yeah, you can't miss it. Good place. Very friendly people, very friendly. Nice. Uh, I'll be trying all kinds of foods. Uh, 
native Moroccans and imported foods, you know, like these pizzas and these tacos and, you know, all these foods that have, that have come from another country, you know, tacos come from Mexico, right? Uh, they have landed here and spread and they became Moroccanized, you know? so, and they're good food. I mean, even the sandwiches, you know, and the burgers and so on, you know, it's, it's native food and non-native food it has their, you know, own Moroccan touch. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, and they, they are good, you know. And do visit Anza Beach, which is, I like it. It's a cool place. And the Green Hornet has been here too, all right? Uh, it's not a sore for <laughs> eyes, <laughs> tired eyes, whatever. Anyway, yeah, whatever. Just want to show you a little bit these, these cool houses, huh? With this changing ever changing uh colors also they have normal houses here and have these small houses i like it it's kind of cool huh? so i will be showing you uh because anza has a great market uh i want to make a, a video so but this we'll just call it the pizza video because i've been meaning to make a pizza video and this so happened to be the you know one of the best pizzas I've had in Morocco so far, and yeah. Anyway, so uh, tune in for the next. You know, I'll, I'll I'll try to show the the market, the beach a little bit, and then of course Agadir and you know whatnot. Okay. Hello. Hello. It's good. Yes. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> Shukran. <laughs> People are very friendly here. Okay. Hey, oh guy. Hey, you're very friendly. You're not so friendly, eh? Yeah? So are you? Oh, yes you are. How about you? All right, you're taking off. She doesn't like moonshine. You have your own house, eh? Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> and yes. Cats around here, eh? Hey. It's a cat city. I like, uh, I like Anza because of the coloring in the small houses. <laughs> I don't know, I like these small houses for some reason. Hey, right, cool, huh? Hanging out the carpets. And there's a little plant here. Cool, huh? I like it. Yeah. Bye bye. Slama.